In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for silver nitrate plus ammonium chromate. So the first thing we'll do is we'll balance the molecular equation. This is our molecular equation up here. I can see that I have just one silver here and two here. Let's put a coefficient of two in front of the silver nitrate. That balances the silver atoms, but now I have two nitrates and just one here. So I'm going to put a two over here. Balances the nitrates. Now I have two ammonium ions but I have two ammonium ions here, so that's fine. And then I have a chromate ion here and a chromate ion here. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Next, we need to write the states for each substance. So for silver, if you know your solubility rules, nitrates are very soluble. We have these nitrates here. So for nitrates, we're gonna put AQ. It's gonna be aqueous, dissolve, dissociate into ions. We also know that compounds with the ammonium ion, they're very soluble. So we're gonna put an AQ for this ammonium chromate. Silver compounds are often insoluble. Silver chromate is insoluble. So you either know that or you look it up on a table of solubility. So because it's insoluble, these two substances react. This falls to the bottom as a precipitate. It's a solid. So we're gonna write an S after the silver chromate. So we have our states. Now let's split the strong electrolytes into ions for the complete ionic equation. Silver is always one plus and the nitrate ion is whole thing one minus. So we have two silver ions, Ag plus, I'll write the states later, plus two of these nitrate ions, NO3 minus. The ammonium ion, the whole thing is one plus, chromate ion is two minus. These are things you remember, you memorize, or you look up if you're allowed to. We have two ammonium ions. So we'll have two of those ammonium ions, and then we'll have just the one chromate ion here, CrO4, 2 minus. These are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we don't split solids apart, so we're just going to write Ag2CrO4 for that silver chromate, and then we said plus and minus, so we have two ammonium ions, just like in the reactants, plus we have two nitrate ions, just like the reactants. So at this point, we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides. So I have my reactants here, and then down here, my products. I see there are two nitrate ions here. In the products, we also have two nitrate ions. These are spectator ions, cross them out. Two ammonium ions right here, and again in the products. Spectator ions get crossed out. What's left, that's the net ionic equation for AgNO3 plus NH42CrO4. Let me clean this up, write the states, we'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for the silver nitrate and ammonium chromate. You note charge is conserved, we have two times one plus, that's two plus, two minus, that gives us a net charge of zero here in the reactants. In the products, this is a neutral compound, so its net charge is zero. Charge is balanced, if you count the atoms up, they're balanced too. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for AgNO3 plus NH42CRO4. Thanks for watching.